Girls are confusing. So the other day, my old lady had one of her girlfriends over. You know, they was in the back room back there trying on dresses. I'm in there eating chips on the couch, watching TV, you know, and I overhear her ask her friend if the dress makes her ass look fat. Not only did her friend tell her that her ass looked fat in the dress, but she called her, and I quote, a bad bitch. <gasps> Gasp. Do you know? what you just did. She's never gonna wear that dress again. Y'all probably ain't gonna be friends anymore. I gotta go get a gym membership now. I'm prepared for the worst. I'm, I'm physically and mentally just preparing myself. And then I heard it from down the hallway, my old lady. Oh my God, thank you. Finally, something to show off my curves. Excuse me? If I would've called her that shit, I would've been sleeping on the couch for a week. I was so confused. I, I didn't I didn't know what to, th I, I just let it go. I, I let it go, I, I, I didn't know what to do with it. Fast forward to earlier this week, my girl's trying on dresses again, cause you know, that's what girls like to do, put on shit that they'll never wear out in public. Only thing is, this time her girlfriend ain't here, so I'm the one gotta be giving the ratings and the opinions and all that. She asked me if the dress makes her ass look fat. At first I knew better, I, my gut instinct kicked in. I was like, nope, don't, don't do it Bryce, don't look into the light. But now I'm all confused. Because a girlfriend don't went and put all this questionable language up in my head. I panicked. I was like, you're a, you're a badass, fat bitch, fat, back ass bit yes anyways i've been living in the trunk of a car for the past three or four days surviving on the diet consisting of my hair and piss it's a good thing i got a head full of hair else i was gonna have to start eating my pubes she eventually let me out though you know someone had to air up the tire although that still don't answer the question why i fell out the car I was getting hydraulics the other night at 3 a.m sound like a raccoon was back there getting jumped by two arabian anteaters or some shit it was real romantic though whoever it was they lit up a cigarette after you know and I felt like this This must be what it's like to be a sex scene in a Hallmark movie, you know? Yep, but, uh, I should, I should probably have a talk to her about that.